The United States has begun to test superfast scout helicopter Sikorsky S-97 Raider, which has a coaxial configuration and push propeller in the tail end. It's based on the experimental helicopter X-2. The first fly of S-97 took place on May 22, 2015 in Florida. The maximum speed of helicopter is 430 km per hour. The service ceiling 3000 meters. The combat radius 570 km. In the nose and the hull, there is double cabin with a side-by-side -side location on two pilots. The cabin is equipped with two side doors of the pilots. In the middle part of the hull there is cargo passenger cabin. According to designer, the helicopter can carry up to six paratroopers, an equivalent quantity of cargo, for example, fuel and weapons. The ordnance is play on small wing with two mounts. In the middle part of the hull, Sikorsky S-97 Raider is equipped with unique axial rotors. At some point the relation speed in the main rotor slows down. The lift is efficient and the forward speed depends entirely on the pusher propeller, while the speed on few new helicopter C S-97 Raider has excited 400 km per hour. Two pilots of S-97 can carry multipurpose guided missiles, a GM-113. Hellfire. In addition, the helicopter is equipped with 7.62 mm machine guns, but the helicopter can perform not only transport reconnaissance but also combat missions. According to Deputy Prime Minister Dmitry Rogozin, the production of high-speed helicopter in Russia will become possible after the scientific and technical work is completed, the deadline for which is set for no late than 2016. The engine QC-3000 for future high-speed helicopter is already being tested, as recently was announced by President Vladimir Putin. A meeting concerning the aircraft engine industry development, which took place on engine building enterprise Klimov in St. Petersburg. This enterprise was chosen to develop a new engine for the high speed helicopter. In Russia, several organizations are working on similar projects simultaneously. The MIG Design Bureau is developing MIG 1, a passenger transport helicopter. What has a co weight of 10 tons and is equipped with two engine VK 2500, capable of carrying 20 passengers of 4 tons of cargo. The estimated cruising speed of the helicopter will be 475 km per hour, and the maximum speed 520 km per hour. MiX-1 will be able to reach the ceiling of 3500 meters and have a range of up to 1550 km. The Camo Design Bureau is working upon K-19, which has a completely new technical design. The helicopter is taken off from the ground by rigid and shortened propeller blades. It gains the speed of 400 km per hour and then the bypass turbofan engine. It started and the helicopter is accelerated to 800 km per hour. Then the blades are automatically folded into the case on the helicopter's top. For landing, the blades are unfolded again. The jet engine is stopped and the helicopter lands normally. The Camov Design Bureau also has K92 project with the maximum speed of 500 km per hour. Its flight range is 1400 km. The capacity 30 passenger and the takeoff weight 16 tons. You are welcome to write what you think on the coaxial design with a pusher propeller in the tail end, and which of a Russian project will finally be implemented. I am Dmitry Bizdone, see you!